The Conference of the Workers' Party of Korea was successfully held in the capital city of Pyongyang on September 28, 2 9 2010. The conference solemnly declared that President Kim Il-sung, who founded and led the WPK and the Korean Revolution, will always remain at the top leadership body of the party. It also invariably held leader Kim Jong-il in high esteem in line with the unanimous desire and wish of all the party members, service persons and other people. The conference elected the central leadership bodies including the party central military commission. It also elected Kim Jong-un as vice chairman of the party central military commission. The conference was a political event of great significance that provided a landmark of great change in developing the WPK into the eternal party of President Kim Il-sung and ushering in the bright future of Songun Korea. The significance and vitality of the conference was proven in practice for the past one year. The spirit of the conference on advancing toward the fresh victory of the socialist construction in the spirit of 1st March, closely rallied around the party, has prevailed throughout the country. The support and trust of the army and the people in the party have grown as never before. Lots of people sent letters pledging their loyalty and expressing confidence in leader Kim Jong-il to the party central committee. The military parade that was held in October 2010 to celebrate the 65th anniversary of the Workers' Party of Korea, the elections of deputies to the provincial, city, and county people's assemblies in July, and the parade of worker peasant Red Guards in September demonstrated the true picture of the DPRK and its might characterized by the harmonious whole of the leader, the party, and the people. Fresh progress has been made in the effort to put the national economy on Juche and modern basis and improve the people's living standards. Kim Jong-il is energetically leading the Korean people in their drive for socialist construction. He visited Hichon Power Station, which is essential for the country's economic development and improving the people's living standards four times from November last year. Emboldened by his visit, the builders built high dam and scores of kilometer long water tunnel, and thanks to their efforts, electricity is expected soon. The Vokus Party of Korea also spurred the development of light industry, which the country set as a major target of this year's general offensive. Another modern phenylon production process came online in the February 8 phenylon complex. The converting and spinning shop was renovated in Hamhong woolen textile mill and it began producing phenylon cloth from March this year. Lots of other light industrial factories also modernized their production processes. There sprang up Pyongyang Flour Processing Factory, Sonhung Food Stuff Factory, Pyongyang Vegetable Scientific Research Institute, Specialist of Ongnyo Restaurant, Hyangmanru Restaurant, Botonggang Department Store, Botongmun Street Meat and Fish Shop, Soy Sauce Shop of Ryongsong Food Stuff Factory, Stuffed Wheat Cake Shop of Gumsong Food Stuff Factory, Pyongyang Stevia Processing Factory, and many other modern production and service centers and research institutes. Vision Drive was waged in Changsong County to develop local industry, and officials and working people in other parts of the country are following the suit to run local industrial plants with their own efforts. A solid groundwork for building on economic power is being laid one upon another in the pilot and all other fields of the national economy. Good
Tech Ion and Steel Complex is taking the lead in this strike sweeping the whole country. The workers of this complex built CNC-based high-temperature air combustion furnace and made many progress in the technological updating. Songjin Steel Complex is displaying the advantages of Juche Steel Production System. Tulima Steel Complex has undergone technological updating and Fanghe Iron Complex began producing heavy rails from June this year. Complex introduced the Korean-style self-baking electro technology and made big progress in putting the metal industry on Juche and modern basis. Many other industrial establishments, including Hichon Ryunha Machine Tool Plant, have been put on CNC basis. The completion of the first phase gasification project in Hungnam is just at hand. Modern geothermal equipment produced by workers of Ryongsong, Juche based fireproof materials in Dancheon, AC locomotive Songun Bulgungi No. 1 developed our own way. His an youth mine that has been facelifted, large conical crushing place in Musan, and modern Nampo glass bottle factory, all these promises the bright prospect of the country's economic development. Epochal changes have been made one after another in the work for the people's well-being. A big sturgeon farming system was set up, and sea farming of sturgeon and rainbow trout made a complete success. A Korean-style combined fish farming research institute sprang up in the area along the east coast, integrating the study, farming and processing of delicious fishes like salmon. Daedonggang combined fruit farm and Gosan fruit farm were expanded, presenting vast sea of fruit trees. The Donggang Combined Fruit Processing Factory allowed the results of the drive to push back the frontiers of the latest science and technology made its new appearance. The hot wind of pushing back the frontiers of the latest science and technology has raged in the general offensive in the present technology-based era. Deluxe apartment houses were built at the foot of 
해방 휠 adding to the happiness of the people. 이스트리트에서이스트리트에서이스트리트에서이스트리트에서이스트리트에서이스트리트에서이스트리트에서이스트리트에서이스트리트에서이스트리트에서이스트리트에서이스트리트에서이스트리트에서이스트리트에서이스